exclusive contract novel from Falu Fiction Network. Death God Challenge Broken Bees, Start with Freedom and Extreme Intention Skill Su Li travels through the world of Death God and becomes a student at the Xinyang Spiritual Art Academy, competing with Lukia for one year. After a year, it's really too weak. Fortunately, the system awakened, and the frog cub unexpectedly brought back the Zijin Ji Gong on its first trip. Challenge the broken bee and shock the soul realm. At this point, a death god who only knows how to fight for free appeared in the death god team. Free extreme intention, eight gates escaping armor, navy six styles, self-extreme intention, destroying energy Lan Ran said, it's impossible. The Zizi Ji Gong even saw through my mirror like water and moon. Yuhaba said, my omniscient and omnipotent cannot see Su Li's moves. Su Li smiled. Death. No, he wants to become a god of destruction. Felu Novel Network reminds you that this novel and its characters are purely fictional. If there are any similarities, they are purely coincidental and should not be imitated. Chapter 1 System Activation, Travel Frog You are listening at NovelFull.audio Corp Soul Realm, Westward Journey Soul Street In a small courtyard a teenage boy is constantly waving his soul-slaying knife. Sweat keeps dripping. He has repeated actions like this at least a thousand times. But he didn't feel tired, instead, he waved even harder. The boy's name is Su Li, and he is a student at Jinyang Lingshu Academy. Apart from his handsome appearance, he is no different from other students. Since his parents went missing, he has been staying at Aunt Inoue's house. Of course, these are only superficial information. In fact, Su Li is a traveler. Due to an accident, he inexplicably traveled to this world of death. Becoming classmates of Rottenwood Rukia, Ase Ranji, and others. Speaking of which, it has been almost a year now. At that moment, a middle-aged woman walked into the courtyard. Ali, today is the weekend and I will be busy until late. Remember to cook and eat by yourself. Aunt Inoue looked a bit tired and shouted. Su Li nodded. Well, I got it. Speaking, Aunt Inoue seemed to remember something again. By the way, in a few days, you will be taking the graduation assessment, right? Right auntie, there are still five days left. Su Li wiped away the sweat from her forehead and answered. Okay, I wish you success in advance. Aunt Inoue smiled and gestured to cheer before leaving. Not long after, Su Li completed 3,000 practice swings and sat on the steps to rest. In a few days, it will be the graduation assessment of Xinyang Lingshu Academy. Since I have traveled to the world of the Grim Reaper and become a Grim Reaper student at the Xinyang Spiritual Academy, there is no doubt that I must become a Grim Reaper. Everyone has come, not to live a grand life and make a name for themselves, how can it be justified? But the problem now is that as a traveler, I have not awakened any system. It's simply embarrassing for the passers-by. Although I have been practicing diligently every day for the past year. But compared to my classmates, there is still a considerable gap. And most importantly, one's spiritual power is pitifully weak. I can't even enter the consciousness space of the soul-slaying blade, let alone know its name. In the world of the Grim Reaper, there are countless strong people, and those classmates who are in the same class as me are even more talented, some of whom can even begin to understand. Although I work hard, can I really make a name for myself in this world? He can't say for sure. For a long time, Su Li finally let out a long breath. Forget it, it's no use thinking so much. Let's practice as soon as possible. At my current level, it's probably difficult for me to even pass the graduation assessment. If you can't even get your graduation certificate, isn't it hilarious? Not to mention making a name for yourself in this world. In my past life, I was at least half a rolling king. I didn't have enough talent, so I worked hard to make ends meet. How could I just casually show off? After speaking, he picked up the soul-slaying blade again and stood up. 
At this moment. Ding a cold mechanical electronic sound echoed in his mind. Detected that the host has been living in the corpse soul realm for at least a year, and the travel frog system has been activated. System. Su Li's expression froze and she was completely bewildered. After a long time, he finally regained his senses and immediately had a look of ecstasy on his face. You have calculated it. My golden finger. It seems that the heavens have not abandoned themselves. But why does this system sound so strange? Travel Frog. Isn't this a popular online game from my past life? The player raises a little frog, which will occasionally travel and bring back some photos and local specialties for the player. Can this also serve as a system? This system is tailor.made for travelers, allowing traveling frogs to explore the heavens and all realms the longer the frog travels, the richer the rewards it brings back, please treat the traveling frog well and take good care of it. TSK TSK, it seems like Yazi is quite powerful. Su Li exclaimed in admiration. Ding! Congratulations to the host for obtaining the beginner gift pack and five travel acceleration cards. This can greatly shorten the frog's travel time. Do you want to claim it now? Claim. Su Li said without hesitation. Before the conversation ends, the travel acceleration card has been stored in the system warehouse. At the same time, a green little frog appeared in front of Su Li. Quack. The meaty little frog looks very cute. This little delicacy looks quite impressive, is it really that impressive? Su Li felt a bit suspicious in her heart. Immediately, he eagerly opened the system panel and pressed the option for travel. However, nothing happened. The traveling frog still croaked incessantly and remained motionless. Isn't this a pit for my dad? Is it possible that my traveling frog is a homestead? Upon hearing this, the frog rolled its eyes and extended its forelimbs to point to its own mouth. Quack. It is obvious that it is hungry. Who is willing to work without food to eat? Okay, let's just consider it as paying you in advance. After Suli finished speaking, he rummaged through the grass in the yard and casually caught some small insects. The traveling frog indulges in a feast, enjoying its expression. When the frog was full, Su Li immediately couldn't wait to click on the option of travel again. This time, the traveling frog finally agreed to move. I saw it tidy up a small package, then plop and jump directly into the air, disappearing. Su Li checked the time on the system. Good guy, it takes a month for the first trip, that's too long. I will be taking the graduation assessment in a few more days, will I have to wait for a month? I'm afraid it's because the rest of the meal has cooled down. Fortunately, there was a newbie reward in the system just now, so Su Li used the travel acceleration card directly. One month's time has been shortened to just five minutes. He sat patiently waiting on the steps. Not long after, the system prompts to receive a photo. This was sent back to him by the frog cub. In the photo, he saw something similar to a arena. And around the arena, there is a sea of stars, with planets towering, looking vast and profound. Where did this little frog go on a trip? Su Li became increasingly curious. It seems that the frog cubs are going to a very amazing world. Not long after. Quack. A frog cry caught Su Li's attention. He looked up and saw that the traveling frog had already returned on the grass in front of him. The originally empty package has now become bulging. Quack. The frog cub pointed to its mouth again, indicating that it was hungry again. Su Li searched in the courtyard again and caught more small insects as a reward, feeding them all. After being full of wine and food, the frog cub opened the package and pushed it towards Su Li. Shua. A dazzling light lit up, revealing a colorful crystal inside the package. It seems to carry a very mysterious aura above. Su Li curiously grasped the crystal. Subsequently, an incredibly powerful force surged into the body. 
In a faint sense, Su Li seemed to see the arena among countless planets. On the arena, two figures are fiercely engaged in battle. One of them is a burly figure with silver hair standing upright. The aura is incredibly powerful. Su Li almost recognized it at a glance. Carrot in the Dragon Ball. Sun Wukong. Su Li exclaimed, Good guy. At the same time, the information in the crystal also poured into his mind in an instant. ZZG skill. The divine skill of the Dragon Ball World God. Even the God of Destruction cannot fully master the divine level skill. Effect. Eliminate all attacks invisibly. Maximize the body's potential, strength, speed, and responsiveness. Chapter 2. ZZG Gong, Breaking the Soul Slaying Blade. You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. ZZG Gong. Su Li was already stunned. He didn't expect the frog cub to bring back such amazing things on their first trip. ZG Gong is a powerful skill in the world of Dragon Ball. One of the divine skills. Even the god of destruction, Pyrrhus, cannot be completely mastered. ZZG Gong can detach the body and consciousness, and respond to various attacks like a conditioned reflex. Both reaction and speed are much faster than actions made through thinking. As Billis said, by thinking first and then responding, the speed will be limited. If every part of the body can judge and take action on its own, it can avoid any danger. Not only can people rely on conditioned reflexes to act, without the need for brain thinking. And it also maximizes movement speed and responsiveness. Things that usually take one or two seconds to react to, but with the help of Zijin Ji Gong, there can be almost no gaps. It is actually a skill that is at the top, like a bug. Imagine, in battle, no matter how fast and fierce the opponent's attack may be. My body can respond in the shortest possible time and fight back perfectly. How strong will one's own strength become? Without a moment of hesitation, Su Li immediately grasped all the knowledge in her mind. After a while, he opened his eyes with a sense of polarity flowing in them. Su Li walked into the courtyard and drew his soul-slaying blade. Immediately pick up a stone from the ground and throw it forcefully. Shu. The stone was thrown out by him with extremely strong force, as fast as a lightning bolt. At the same time, Su Li's figure flashed and the next moment he appeared in front of the flying trajectory of the stone. There was no need for the brain to think, his body reacted on its own. Hands up and knives down. The stone is divided into two. Without any pause, Su Li slapped the stone in half with a blade. The two stones flew back at an extremely high speed. Shu. Su Li flashed again, even faster than before. The stones are splitting again. So repeated. Until the stones were completely shattered into fragments in the end. Su Li didn't even get a speck of dust on her body. At this moment, Su Li's face was completely covered in joy. With the ZZG Gong, it means he can deal with anyone's attack. Even the renowned Instant God Knight One for his speed, or the decaying Wood by Zai for releasing Thousand Sakura Jin Yen, he is confident in avoiding the opponent's attack. As long as his physical strength can withstand it, the ZZG Gong will always be in a state of activation. Integrated Attack and Defense Flawless. Su Li couldn't help but burst into laughter at the thought of this. It seems that it is not impossible for oneself to dominate the world of death. It seems that to celebrate the progress of the owner, Su Li's soul slaying blade also sent a congratulatory message. Bang dang. His soul slaying sword unexpectedly broke apart from it, shattering into several pieces and falling to the ground. Sleeping slot. What's the situation? Su Li was shocked and pale. It must be during the trial just now that he exerted too much force, and the soul-slaying blade couldn't withstand such a powerful force for a while, which led to the fracture of the blade. If it's for the average Grim Reaper, this is not a big deal, after all, breaking a sword can happen occasionally. 
Normally, as long as the death god enters the consciousness space of the soul slaying blade, talks to the soul body inside the blade, receives help from the soul body, and inputs some of his spiritual power, the blade will return to its original state. But the problem now is that Su Li can't even enter the consciousness space. Moreover, at times like this, the Zero Team has not yet emerged. The two houses of Wang Yu, who crafted the soul slaying blade, towered in the Phoenix Palace. How could he have time to help a student who has not yet graduated repair the blade? His soul slaying blade is simply impossible to repair. Isn't this the end of the calf? Su Li's eyes widened, wanting to cry without tears. After a long time, Su Li looked at the soul slaying knife glued together with glue, his face full of depression. Sticky is good, but it definitely won't work anymore. Without the soul slaying blade, how will one fight in the future? Ghost Way. I don't seem to be good at that. How can we deal with this? Am I really going to become the first male boxer in the corpse soul realm? Su Li looked up and sighed, silently inserting the soul slaying blade back into its sheath. From now on, this soul slaying blade can only be used as a decoration. Slash the fist and leave the ghost. I can't use the soul slaying blade anymore, and I'm not good at it myself. It seems that before his soul slaying sword is repaired, he may have to fight with his fists. Shallow fighting is not enough, let's make do with free fighting. This made Su Li somewhat depressed. Fortunately, I have been practicing free combat for a year, and now that I have gained the ZEG Gong, its impact should not be too significant. Immediately, he turned his head and found the frog cub lying on the steps with all fours facing upwards. Sleeping in the trough. Can't even the frog cub hiccup. Su Li was startled and quickly ran over to check. The soul slaying blade is broken. If the frog cub has another accident, he will really curse his mother. After a moment, Su Li finally relaxed. The frog cub should just be tired and sleeping soundly. The system panel also indicates that the travel frog is resting. The longer the travel time, the longer the rest time. I went out for a month this time, and the frog cub had to rest for a full five days to recover. Be good, sleep well and wake up with more food for you. Su Li's eyes were gentle, gently caressing the bulging belly of the frog cub, and then putting it back into the system warehouse. And he himself stood up, ready to start practicing again. However, now there is no soul slaying sword, and his training content has changed from swordsmanship to boxing. Even if you have an incredible system, you cannot give up on hard work training. This is the creed of the king of scrolls. No matter how talented one is, without the watering of sweat, they cannot bear sweet fruits. To dominate the world of death, one must work harder than everyone else. Only in this way can we be stronger than everyone else. In the courtyard, there were gusts of fist wind and hunting sounds. The youth's cultivation did not end until late at night. Five days passed quickly. The students of Xinyang Lingshu Academy have finally received their final graduation assessment. Early in the morning, the playground of the college was filled with students, all with excited expressions and tense expressions. Not only because today is the graduation assessment. At the same time, today is also the selection and assessment of the members of the 13th Guard team. Graduation assessment, also known as selection assessment. Students with excellent performance will be admitted to the 13th Guard team. Those with lower grades will be assigned to the Ghost Sect or the Hidden Mobile team. So, when the members of the 13th Guard team appeared on the trial field, it immediately caused a stir in the crowd. The students below were extremely excited and their eyes were extremely eager. That's the 13th Guard team. The strongest existence in the corpse soul realm. Joining the 13 Guard teams is the dream of countless young girls. That is the supreme glory. Unexpectedly, the leader of the team's assessment this time was Captain Suifong. Wow, really, Captain Suifong is such a perfect goddess, beautiful and spirited. The bald guy next to him is Banmui Chiro, 
the deputy captain of the 11th team, right. The guy next to him, who is not male or female, is Maes Kawakami. My mom, with so many big shots, I'm so nervous and want to vomit, you. The students below were extremely excited. And among the crowd, Suli also felt a little excited inside. After several days of cultivation, he has become very proficient in using the Freedom Extreme, and his strength and speed have been greatly improved. He really wants to know what level he can achieve in the assessment with his current strength. Swayphone looked arrogantly at the students below, with a cold and aloof expression. She didn't say too much. Let's get started. Chapter 3 Graduation Assessment, Get Off to a Good Start You are listening at NovelFull.audio With a dull drumbeat, the graduation assessment officially began. The content of the exam is mainly divided into two stages. The first step is to take the exam of Jean Quan and get away with ghosts. Slash, also known as Shallow Strike, is a soul-cutting sword. Fist, also known as Free Combat. To walk is to take a quick step. Ghost is the path of ghosts. Candidates go to the corresponding examination room to participate in the exam and showcase their four skills. The invigilator will give corresponding scores based on the performance of the candidates. The maximum score for each subject is 100 points. A score of 60 is considered a pass, 80 is considered excellent, and above 90 is considered outstanding. If the total score of the four subjects adds up to 240 points, it is considered qualified and can obtain a graduation certificate. Only those who achieve a total score of 320 or excel in a single subject can enter the second stage of the assessment. The students walked towards the examination room one by one. Su Li also followed the army to his own examination room. The first assessment item is shallow typing. Name, class. The invigilator didn't look up and asked casually. Su Li, class 1, grade 6. Su Li calmly answered. Okay, you can start now. I abstain. What? The invigilator suddenly lifted his head, his face full of disbelief. What are you saying? The invigilator thought he had heard wrong and asked again, unsure. I abstain, teacher. Su Li said calmly. The invigilator was immediately stunned. He has been invigilating for so many years and has never seen a student voluntarily give up the exam. Are you sure? I'm sure. Su Li said lightly. Just kidding, the glue on the soul slaying blade hasn't dried yet. Let him take it out for the exam. It's better to just poop on the street. Seeing the calm and composed expression on Su Li's face, the invigilator couldn't help but feel a little angry in his heart. He has been in the industry for so many years and has never seen such an absurd student. Surprisingly, he just gave up the exam. Immediately, the invigilator made a heavy cross in the grading bar with a red pen. Su Li, shallow hit, zero points. Su Li nodded slightly in greeting and then left simply. Watching Su Li's graceful departure, the anger on the invigilator's face could not be calmed for a long time. Not long after, the venue for the Ghost Road Assessment. Breaking the Way 31. Red Cannon. What? This student, please be serious. Smoking is not allowed in the exam venue. What? This is your Red Cannon. Are you sure it's not your lighter? Puff. Ha ha ha. I'm sorry. We have received professional training and usually don't laugh unless. Ha ha ha. Sorry, this student. We can only give you five points. One point is your grade, and the remaining four points are from us. Thank you for bringing us joy. Next up. Suli walked out of the exam venue with an awkward expression on her face. My own level of ghost art is really on par with Asani's love affair. Then he shook his head and regained his composure. Forget it, it's just a passing game, it doesn't matter how many points you get. 
shallow fight and ghost path were things I had planned to give up from the beginning. As long as the remaining two subjects can achieve excellence, one can enter the second round of assessment. The second round of assessment is the truly important final assessment. As long as you can pass the second round of assessment, not only can you enter the 13th team of the court protection team, but you can also obtain your graduation certificate unconditionally. This is undoubtedly the optimal solution for Su Li, who has difficulty obtaining a graduation certificate through conventional means. He sorted his thoughts and then walked towards the third subject exam venue. On the playground, some students who have just completed the assessment are resting. Do you know that when I just took the shallow level exam, a guy scored zero? What? Zero points. Even if I draw a knife, it's not even zero points, right? How did I take the exam? I don't know, it seems like I just gave up the exam and made that invigilator so angry that his beard was crooked. Ha ha ha, who is so fierce that even the most basic 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 skills have been abandoned in the exam? Are you planning to not have a graduation certificate? It seems like it's called Su Li or something. It's like they're in their class for a second time. Sleeping slot, this guy just had an exam with me. He's in front of me. Do you know how many points he scored on the ghost test? How many points? Five points. I'll be obedient. His red cannon is just like the match lit by the second master at the village entrance, making those two invigilators laugh so hard. Bull, I would like to call it the strongest academic scum of the year. Good guy, we had a hard time dating Asanji. That guy got a score of 6 on the ghost test. The problem is that he scored 92 points for his shallow love affair. And he is the only student in this class who was able to liberate Shiji during his college years. I can only say that there is also a gap between academic achievers. At the same time, the free play assessment venue. A wooden puppet standing tall, standing still in the center of the venue. This wooden puppet is made by the Technical Development Bureau and has an exceptionally strong body. It can attack enemies within a certain range on its own and is specifically used for training and assessment of students in the college for free combat. The assessment method is also very simple. Candidates engage in combat with puppets using white combat until the puppets are destroyed. The less time it takes, the fewer times it is hit by the puppet, and the higher the score obtained. If you can destroy the puppet within 5 minutes and get hit less than 3 times, you can get a score of 90 or more. If you can destroy the puppet within 3 minutes without being hit once, then you can get full marks. Although it may sound simple, it is difficult to do. The wooden puppet is exceptionally sturdy and it is not easy to destroy it. Moreover, the puppet's attack is very fast, and even a slight mistake can lead to being hit. Since the establishment of the college, there have only been two individuals who have achieved outstanding scores of 90 in the free play assessment. Captain of the first two teams, one night at the Four Maple Courtyard. And the current captain of the second team, Sui Fong. As for those who can get full marks, no one has yet achieved it. Classmate, you can start now. The invigilator nodded to Su Li and immediately placed his hand on the start switch. Su Li nodded calmly. Immediately, the invigilator pressed the switch and started timing at the same time. Jiya Jiya. The wooden puppet's body began to wriggle at high speed, ready to launch an attack on the boy in front of it. However, the next second. Bang! A tremendous force directly turned the puppet into flying sawdust. Su Li looked at her fist with some surprise. I didn't expect my strength to grow so much. He immediately regained his composure, withdrew his fist, patted the dust off his body, and dispersed his extreme sense of freedom. Teacher, I'm done with it. The invigilator looked at the flying sawdust in the sky, and then at Su Li, who had a calm and carefree face. People are all foolish. What? Not long after, the same scene also appeared in the assessment venue of Instagram. The content of the assessment is to dodge the ball. 
For each successful dodge, the machine will add a ball. If hit, the assessment ends. 16 are considered passing, 32 are considered excellent, and 64 are considered excellent. Don't think about creating miracles, I'll tell you, only the former captain of the second team has been able to reach 64 over the years. Dot. Hey, this student is pretty good, he already has 32. Well, it's really good. There are already 48 of them. Ah. Uh. 64, 87. 101, 112. 128 pieces. The invigilator looked at the closed assessment room, with countless rapidly bouncing small balls, and everyone was dumbfounded. 128 balls are already all the balls in the machine. This student surprisingly managed to maintain a quick step amidst so many small balls, and didn't get hit even once. Teacher, that machine won't spit the ball anymore. Can you see if it's broken? Su Li kept flashing in the room while still reminding her. What? The invigilator was completely dumbfounded. Chapter 4 Shocking Full marks for both subjects. You are listening at novelfull.audio. Not long after, all the candidates completed the first round of assessment. On the school bulletin board, the grades for four subjects and a list of individuals who have entered the second round of assessment are posted. Nearly a thousand fresh graduates, but less than 50 of them successfully entered the second round of assessment. This includes people such as Asani Yoshinaga, Yoshitaka Yoshinaga, and Chomori Momo. People looked at the over 40 names on the list with envy in their eyes. These people are all real elites. It is very likely to become a key player in various teams in the future. And those of us who fail to enter the second round of assessment can only wait for distribution. If lucky, perhaps one can still secure a spot at the end and become a substitute for each team. If you're a little unlucky, you'll have to go to the ghost sect or the hidden mobile team. People look at the names on their transcripts with different emotions, envy, jealousy, and admiration. Subsequently, people turn their attention to the transcripts of the four subjects. First place in shallow play, second in love with Ase, 92 points, outstanding. This is not surprising, after all, Ase Ranji is the only graduate this year who was able to liberate Shiji during his college years. Shallow in second and third place, then Chomori Momo and Yoshitaka Ichikawa. I didn't expect that the top three students in the shallow fighting class were all from class one, truly worthy of being top students. People all sighed and immediately looked at the Ghost Road transcript. First place in the Ghost Road, Chusen Peach, 89 points, excellent. It's a pity that you can achieve excellence by just one point. However, it is already a very good result. After all, Ghost Art is an extremely tedious and complex combat technique that requires not only absolute focus, but also proficiency in the singing and recitation of various ghost arts. It is not enough to make a single mistake. So, being able to score above 80 is basically considered a genius. The second place winner, Jiliang Yiha, scored 80 points and just reached the excellent line. The third place is Gibu Yamada, who scored 78 points and is also a student in class 1. TSK TSK, the top 3 in the ghost world are from the same group again, that's too strong. Alas, I worked hard to get a score of 60, and I'm too far behind these top students. Hehe, he, the top class is the top class, not only winning first place, but also taking the last place. In the crowd, some slightly sour sound sounded. Su Li, Class 1, Grade 6, give a shallow score of 0, come in last. Su Li, Class 1, Ghost Road 5 points, last to last. A Shanjing Renji, Class 1, Ghost Road 6 points, second to last. Class 1 is really strong, they have to occupy both the top and bottom of the list. Ha ha ha. The ones who made sarcastic remarks were obviously students from other classes who were dissatisfied with one class. However, this statement did indeed attract people's attention. P. 
People looked at Su Li's name at the bottom of their transcript with a mocking expression on their faces, emitting bursts of ridicule. The total scores of two subjects can be counted with one hand. Such a guy, let alone become a god of death, probably won't even get a graduation certificate. It can also be considered the top of the list of academic achievers. I really don't know how I got into the Xinyang Lingshu Academy back then. Amidst the crowd, Ase Ai buried his face deep under the brim of his hat, blushing with embarrassment. This idiot is really embarrassing. He muttered with an unpleasant expression, completely forgetting that he was also one of the bottom players. After a long time, the crowd gradually quieted down and no longer paid attention to Su Li's performance. After all, guys like this who can't even complete their careers may not be from the same world as them in the future, so why waste your energy paying attention to them? Immediately, people turned their attention to the remaining two subjects. White Top, Su Li, 100 points, perfect. Instantly ranked first, Su Li, 100 points, perfect. Two transcripts, Su Li's name is at the top of the list. Ah, this. The crowd of onlookers suddenly took a deep breath. A deadly silence at the scene. People can't believe their eyes. Su Li, that shallow player with zero points in a ghost road with only five points, Su Li. That two subjects with a total score that can be counted with just one hand is really smart. Surprisingly, I got full marks in two subjects. This is a perfect score. It's not 90 points, it's not 95 points, it's 100 out of 100. If the score from 80 to 90 is a gap, then the score from 90 to 100 is a chasm. The former, relying on diligence and sweat, may still be able to overcome. The latter is beyond the reach of human resources. Without absolute talent, relying solely on hard work cannot achieve a perfect score of 100 points. Since the establishment of the college, no one has ever achieved full marks. Not a single one. Even the young prodigy who became famous at a young age, the current captain of the San Fan team, Shimaru In, only scored a maximum of 98 points. However, now, this previously ridiculed academic scumbag, this Suli who even struggles to graduate, has made history. And it's still a perfect score for two subjects. The current candidates are deeply shocked. They only now know that beyond excellence, there is also a rating. 100 points, perfect. Amidst the crowd, Asanji Ranji was already shocked and speechless as she looked at Su Li's name on the list. Is this really the Su Li he knows? Su Li, who is the last one in class? Dong Dong Dong. A deep drumbeat sounded, announcing that the second round of assessment was about to begin. The candidates resting on the playground began to gather towards the martial arts arena. The second round of assessment is also the final assessment. The assessment content is very simple and straightforward. The 13th team of court protection will send their own team members to compete with the candidates in order to test their strength. At the same time, based on the candidate's performance during the war, determine what kind of seats will be awarded later. Candidates can decide which team to participate in the assessment based on their own intentions. But no matter which team you choose, the result will not be easy. Because the players sent by each team are basically the top five in the team. Some teams may even send out the first three players. After all, the strength of the newcomers is also very important for the 13th team of the court protection team, and no matter how much emphasis is placed, it cannot be overemphasized. So, there has always been a saying. As long as the candidate persists for five minutes without being defeated in the second round of assessment, they will have at least the strength of the top ten seats. The longer you persist, the stronger your strength, and the higher the number of seats you will be awarded afterwards. Not long after. The deep drumbeat rang out again. The second round of assessment has officially begun. Under the attention of all the teachers and students, the first candidate walked onto the trial field. He is the top scorer in the grade, Komori Momo. The students in the audience cheered and cheered for the first place in the grade. Immediately, 
a fierce battle broke out on the trial field. Under the full attack of Kenjiro, the fifth seat of the fifth team, Komori Tao only held on for five minutes before being hit by a lightning strike from the opponent in the eleventh game of the Pathfinder, losing consciousness. Although she only persisted for five minutes, it is enough to prove that Jamori Tao has the ability to become one of the top ten, and it also proves that her ability to get first place in the grade is not just a false reputation. Chumori Tao successfully joined the fifth team. Subsequently, Yoshihiro Aiki also successfully passed the assessment and joined the third team, persisting for five and a half minutes. It is worth mentioning that Asani's second love affair. This guy didn't know what kind of stimulation he had, but his fighting spirit was exceptionally high. He played with the three seats of the sixth team for a full ten minutes. Although Asani's love affair can be resolved, it still appears too immature in front of experienced seniors. In the end, he couldn't hold on in the eleventh minute and was defeated. However, the audience on site still gave the warmest applause. Even many members of the 13th Guard team stood up and applauded for him. Being able to play with the three seats to this extent is enough to prove the strength of Asani's relationship. Even many people believe that Asani's second love affair is the ceiling of this year's graduates' fighting power. Based on his performance, it is highly likely that he will enter the top five spots of the fan team in the future. Subsequently, Ase Ryoji also successfully joined the sixth team. Afterwards, the candidates were assessed one after another, but ultimately not many people were able to persist until five minutes. Only a few dozen or so people succeeded in the assessment and joined the team they wanted to join. And those who did not pass the assessment can only wait for future allocation. Time passed quickly, and in the blink of an eye, the assessment came to an end. Only the last candidate remains. Class 1, Grade 6 Su Li. With the cheers of the invigilators, Su Li walked calmly onto the martial arts stage. Which team do you want to assess? The invigilator asked. Su Li smiled slightly and said the answer in her heart. I want to take the second team exam. This was something Su Li had already planned. The second team is also the superior organization in charge of the covert mobile team. The captain of the second team is the commander. In. Chief of the covert maneuvering team. The secret mobile team, as the most powerful unit in the corp soul realm, is also responsible for punishment, assassination, intelligence, and defending the jingling court. It is an incredibly powerful army. If you want to dominate the world of death, there is no reason not to take this army and make it your support. Moreover, to put it bluntly, if I could control this army, I would be better equipped to deal with future Blue Dye Rebellion and Invisible Empire invasion. So, joining the second team is inevitable. Ah, uh, ah, uh, finally someone has come to take the second team exam. Accompanied by a gentle burst of laughter, the deputy captain of the second team, the Chien Tian, performed martial arts on stage. Chapter 5 Quickly Kill Omida and Challenge Suifong you are listening at NovelFull.audio. Due to no one participating in the assessment of the second team before, the members of the second team have always been in a state of observation. Although relaxed, sitting and watching like this all the time inevitably makes me feel a bit bored. Moreover, as time goes by, seeing more and more outstanding candidates joining other teams, the members of the second team inevitably become somewhat anxious. So, when Su Li announced that he was going to take the second team exam, the Chien Tian immediately rushed forward with a fierce roar. Sui Feng also sat slightly upright and looked towards the martial arts stage. Previously, she had always been in a semi-empty state, and even though Asani's love affair was over, she showed a lack of interest. It wasn't until then that someone assessed the second team that her interest finally arose. After all, it concerns the interests of our team, and as the captain, Sui Feng will certainly raise his spirits. Isn't it true that the second team sent the vice captain out for assessment? This is a bit too serious. TSK TSK, I see this guy is a bit hung up. He's actually facing the deputy captain, probably not even able to hold on for a minute. Su Li. 
I have a slight impression of this person. Isn't he the last one in class one? Why did he also enter the second round? I'll go, big brother. You're lagging behind in terms of information, right? They got perfect scores for both the free play and instant steps. Absolutely big shot. Blow it off, you got a perfect score. No one in the history of the entire college has ever received a perfect score, don't deceive anyone. Really, if you don't believe it, go check the bulletin board yourself. Corpse soul people don't deceive corpse soul people. The candidates in the audience were discussing extensively. Although the results of the four subjects have been announced, there are still many people who have not gone to see them. So, most candidates, seeing that Su Li was actually the vice captain of the second team, couldn't help but feel sorry for him. After all, those who can enter the second round of assessment are mostly the elites among graduates. If we can pass smoothly and secure the top ten seats, everyone will also feel honored. The invigilator walked up to the stage and handed the candidate information in his hand to Omida. Unexpectedly, the Qian Tian didn't even look. His face was already filled with excitement and thirst. Sitting off the field for too long, his heart had already become restless and restless. The Maeda drew out his soul-slaying blade with a swoosh. Come on, kid, draw your sword and let me see if you have the strength to join the second team. Looking at the excited De Qian Tian, Su Li's expression remained calm. I don't want to use a knife. His words left Oda stunned and confused. No need for a knife. How are you planning to fight me? Su Li did not answer his question, but instead pondered for a while before asking in reverse. I remember there was a rule in the thirteenth team of the court protection that if subordinates were dissatisfied with their superiors, they could initiate a challenge. If the challenge is successful, you can get the opponent's seat, right? The Maeda scratched his head in confusion and said. Kid, what exactly are you trying to say? Su Li smiled slightly, with a confident and composed expression on her face. I want to challenge Captain Broken B. As soon as these words were spoken, the whole room fell silent. Everyone's mouths are open in an O-dot shape. Does this guy know what he's talking about? This is no longer a problem of self-doubt. This is simply outrageous. Kid, do you know what you're talking about? The Maeda suddenly became furious and shouted loudly. I want to challenge Captain Swayfoam to become the new captain of the second team. Su Li repeated again, her tone extremely calm. Bah ga! How arrogant! Stinky kid, I must teach you a lesson today and let you know what, heaven and earth are thick, means. Come on! Pull out your knife! Fight me! Two years ago, I was furious and drank it. With a flick of my wrist, I was able to directly initiate the solution. Looking at the terrifying meteor hammer, Many students in the audience were frightened and dared not make any sound, as if they were standing in front of the meteor hammer at this moment. I've said it before, I don't want to use a knife. Su Li said lightly. Then you go to hell. Ba Jie Yalu. The Qian Tian roared and rushed toward Su Li, but the invigilators around him couldn't stop him in time. Underneath the stage, many students chose to close their eyes as they couldn't bear to see the scene of Su Li being thrown away by the five-shaped head. Ah, this idiot, why are you so arrogant? Asani Eiji couldn't bear to see it again. In everyone's hearts, Su Li will become a flying man in the air in the next second, spitting blood and flying out of the field. After all, his opponent is at the vice-captain level, and in the face of absolute power, they are all pale together. At the VIP seat, Swayfong had already stood up with a serious expression, ready to intervene at any time. Graduation assessment, there must be no serious injury or death of candidates. The Qian Tian is so impulsive, he even takes his child's big talk seriously. However, the next second. Bang! A loud bang! The Qian Tian flew straight out of the field and crashed into the wall of the stands. The five-shaped head shattered into several pieces and fell to the ground. 
the Chien Tian spat out a mouthful of blood and immediately collapsed, losing consciousness. Hush. Everyone took a breath of cold air in unison. The whole place is as quiet as death. No one dares to believe that this is the end. Originally, the unilateral crushing turned out to be Su Li's quick kill of De Chien Tian. Su Li withdrew her legs and patted the dust on her pants, her expression relaxed. Hey, Maeda, hey, stop pretending. The broken bee was the first to react and shouted at Omida lying on the ground. She is very clear about her deputy's personality, greedy for money and lust, timid and afraid of war. She must be pretending to be like this now. Shouldn't you have taken this kid's money, right? That's why I was the first to rush up. Two people acting together. Sui Feng's expression was slightly cold, and then he jumped down and walked to Demaeda's side, then kicked him hard. The Qian Tian had no response. The broken bee immediately placed its hand on his pulse. After a moment, the broken bee finally showed an incredulous expression on its face. I'm really dizzy. The sound of broken bees gently drifted in the extremely quiet venue, like a stone, crashing into the calm water surface. Bang! Suddenly stirred up a thousand waves. The people on site finally woke up and immediately erupted into a deafening commotion. Oh my god! Is this true? You don't even need a soul-slaying blade. Can you instantly kill the vice-captain with just one strike? Don't even use a knife. Kick off the deputy captain's explanation with just one leg. What leg is this? Ah. Who can tell me? It's so terrifying. Is this the perfect score for free? It's simply outrageous. Sleeping slot, I originally wanted to say, this guy, he doesn't even pull out a knife, is he fixing him? Now I realize it's my mistake. He really got it. Woo woo, so handsome. Su Li, forgive me for being blind. I used to think you were just a good dot looking academic scumbag, but I didn't expect you to be a male theological bully. With Su Li's strength, he probably can become the vice captain directly, right? No, is it really like what he said, he wants to be the captain? Sleeping slot. Sixteen year old captain. It's scary to think about it. Silence. The invigilator let out a roar. The noise gradually subsided, but people continued to engage in intense discussions in low voices below. Take him for treatment. Sway Fong glanced at Demaeda lying unconscious on the ground and said coldly. Immediately looked at Su Li on the martial arts stage. As for you. Very good. The broken bee slowly walked towards the stage of martial arts, its eyes as cold as frost. Her deputy was injured, she wouldn't give up on it. She picked up the candidate profile on the ground and flipped through it a few times. Humph, the Chen Tian, this idiot, didn't even understand who his opponent was. Shallow score is zero points, ghost path is five points, white score and instant step are full marks. Interesting. Really interesting. Sui Fong looked at Su Li, and his originally cold expression finally changed slightly, with a rare excitement in his eyes. The words of the broken bee immediately restored the quietness of the students below. The fact that Su Li scored full marks in both subjects finally made the whole school aware. All the candidates were deeply shocked and couldn't come back to their senses for a long time. However, what shocked them even more is still ahead. The broken bee slowly took off the captain's coat and sneered, saying. Although I don't know why you don't want to use the soul-slaying blade, it's not important to me. You're very strong, you're very similar to a guy I know. Although the rules you mentioned earlier are actually special rules that only the eleventh team has, and other teams do not have them, but. With one hand flicking, the captain's coat fluttered in the wind and landed below the stage. Her lips curved slightly, and her fighting spirit rose high. I, accept your challenge. Chapter 6 The Chase of Electric Firestone, Suli vs. Suifong You are listening at NovelFull.audio 
I, accept your challenge. If you can defeat me, become the captain of the second team. The broken bee's face was cold and stern, and a strong sense of war rose in its eyes. As soon as this statement was made, the audience below immediately exploded. Sleeping slot. Isn't it? How could Captain Swayfone really accept a challenge? Graduation assessment has turned into a battle for the captain's position directly. Isn't this a big deal? Fresh graduates challenge the current captain. Who dares to believe this? This Suli is too crazy. They have crazy capital. They killed the vice captain in a flash. Can you replace them with you? In my opinion, this guy's strength is at least at the level of vice captain. It's hard to say, he may even have captain level strength. When did our college produce such a terrifying genius? Why haven't we heard of it before? The students below were excitedly discussing. On the stands, a group of members from the 13th team of the protective court were also discussing. Hey, did you just see clearly? That kid's move. No, it's too fast. In the blink of an eye, the Maeda lost and didn't even have a chance to see clearly. This kid, when he uses his moves, there is no spiritual pressure fluctuation, and he feels like an ordinary person. But unfortunately, the destructive power was extremely strong, and with just one kick, Vice Captain Omida's soul slaying blade was shattered. The members of the 13th team of the court protection team have complex expressions. This kid is really good. It would be perfect to come to our 11th team. Banmo looked at Su Li on the stage with a bright gaze and a faint expression of desire for battle on his face. TSK TSK, this kind of talent, our 11th team can't miss it. We need to inform Captain Jinba quickly. Ayase Kawakami gave a charming smile and immediately took out the communicator. The members of each team gradually reacted and looked at Su Li on stage, their eyes suddenly becoming fiery. A talented young man with such formidable strength must not miss his own team. With a little training, one can definitely become one of the big shots of the fan team in the future. The stands suddenly became restless, and members of each team planned to throw their olive branches at Su Li. It's also funny to say that the graduation assessment is not over yet, and each team is ready to start competing for talent. Feeling the restlessness behind, the broken bee let out a cold snort. She certainly knows what these guys are thinking. It's just that her relationship with this young man is not over yet. No one wants to interfere until she finishes teaching this young man a lesson. Hey, kid, how are you doing? I've accepted your challenge, haven't you expressed anything? Or are you afraid? In the end, you're just a tomboy who likes to talk big. The broken bee held its head high and looked coldly at Su Li, sneering. Su Li smiled slightly. Come on, Captain Broken Bee. Upon hearing this, the expression on the face of the Broken Bee suddenly became excited, and a sense of war rose in its eyes. Great. I just like guys with backbone. The people around suddenly fell silent when they saw the situation. People didn't expect that the two people on stage would really start fighting. Kid, your strongest ones are Baida and Shanbu, right? Coincidentally, I am too. If you don't want to use the soul slaying blade, then, for the sake of fairness, I won't use the soul slaying blade either. Let's take a showdown of by de and instant steps. Let me see, what level are you, a genius with perfect scores in two subjects? The broken bee sneered and then put on a combat posture. By the way, by the way, let me remind you. There was a hint of mockery on her face. Although you can instantly kill Omida with just one strike, Omida's strength is the weakest among all vice captains. Now, standing in front of you is a truly authentic captain level existence. If you have a lucky heart, you will lose very miserably. Because I won't be lenient. So, please show all your strength. Upon hearing this, Suli only smiled calmly. Okay, thank you for your advice. Looking at the calm and calm young man in front of me, 
the cold in the eyes of the broken bee became even more intense, and I felt a slight chill in my heart for no reason. She can't see through this young man. Immediately after, without any warning. The broken bee's body flickered and disappeared in place. In an ultra-fast instant, the figure of the broken bee appeared in front of Suli in an instant. There is no preparation, no start. The broken bee suddenly launched an attack like this. This surprised the audience on sight. Unexpectedly, in the battle between a graduate and an active captain, the captain launched an attack first. And it was such a crisp and sharp raid. The audience at the scene was greatly surprised. However, upon closer reflection, this is not something difficult to understand. As the captain of the second team, Sui Fong is in charge of the most powerful violent organization in the corpse soul realm. She is decisive in her actions and decisive in her actions, which is her personality. Without any fancy movements, Sui Fong punched Su Li directly. The terrifying force within the fist roars even in the air. Everyone's hearts were raised to their throats. As if the next second, the young man's fragile body would be hit by a fist, and then fly out like a broken kite. Many people couldn't bear to close their eyes. However, in the next moment, everyone witnessed an incredible scene. The broken bee's fist unexpectedly hit empty. The broken bee looked at the empty floor in front of it, with a somewhat confused expression. However, the next second, her face changed drastically. Su Li's figure unexpectedly appeared behind her. The broken bee was greatly shocked. My own instant step, but the fastest among all active captains. This guy is even faster than himself. The broken bee immediately let out a loud shout, unleashing an astonishing momentum, forcefully twisting its body and striking Su Li behind it at a faster speed. Su Li disappeared again, and the broken bee's fist still went blank. The next second, Su Li's figure appeared five meters away, with a faint smile on her face. Seeing the calm smile on the young man's face, the broken bee became furious and took another quick step, attacking the opponent at a faster speed than before. Su Li also disappeared in place again. Between the lightning and flint, the figures of both sides kept flashing on the martial arts stage. In just over a dozen seconds, the two of them chased after each other and used hundreds of instant steps. The audience at the scene were dazzled. The figures on stage were intertwined, making it impossible to see who was who. I can only hear the roar of broken bees intermittently. Stinky kid. Do you only know how to run away? Do you dare to confront me head dot on? The broken bee's heart was almost going crazy. She was already exerting all her strength in the blink of an eye, but to her surprise, she couldn't even touch the other person's hem. The speed of the youth made her feel deeply powerless. For so many years, there has only been one person who can make the broken bee feel this way. That is her former captain, who is also the person she admires the most, Yi Yi from Siphon Jiwen. Does this kid's instant step have already reached the level of Lord Yi Yi? The shattered bee was shocked to think. Meanwhile, the audience below had already been stunned. Crouching slot. Captain Suifeng, who is known as the strongest instant step in active service, can't even touch Su Li's shadow. Is this the power of instant steps with perfect scores? Isn't this too terrifying? Um. How do I feel, this guy is playing with Captain Suifeng. Captain Suifeng is so anxious. People were deeply shocked by the crazy pursuit on stage. Suddenly, Su Li stopped and revealed her figure. The broken bee didn't stop for a moment and almost fell directly onto Su Li. She finally stood firm and looked up angrily, only to find that Su Li was muttering something. Well, both speed and reaction have become much stronger. Next, let's try our strength. Su Li murmured thoughtfully. It turned out that Su Li was using a broken bee to test her speed and reaction ability during the brief chase just now. Sui Fong was not sure what Su Li was saying. Her face was flushed and she was about to question why the other party suddenly stopped. Immediately, 
she saw Su Li slowly lifting his fist. The broken bee's eyes lit up instantly, and its inner wariness was ignited once again. This kid is finally willing to confront himself head dot on. I need to make him understand what true power is. Immediately, Sui Feng sneered and raised his fist, ready to confront Su Li head dot on. However, Su Li's fist came even faster than she had imagined. Boom! The broken bee was even hit with a fist before it had time to dodge. Puff, a mouthful of fresh blood spurted out from her mouth. Broken bees fly out of the field like broken kites. Chapter 7 Sting and Kill All Enemies Bird Bee You are listening at Novel Full. Audio. Accompanied by a clear bloodline, the figure of the broken bee flew towards the outside of the field. After several twists and turns in mid-air, the broken bee struggled to stabilize its body. She stood in mid-air with a disheveled figure, bloodstains still hanging on her lips, and her expression was extremely shocked. Surprisingly, I was knocked away by a graduate. This is simply unbelievable to her. Swayphone lifted his head and looked at the young man on the field, with a deep shock in his eyes. This young man named Su Li is incredibly strong. Even if the instant step is faster than oneself, it's okay. Even the speed of the attack is so fast. I took action at the same time as him, but I didn't even have half his speed. Moreover, with just one punch, one can knock oneself off the ground, causing considerable damage and absolute strength. Does this guy really have captain level strength? The heart of the broken bee was extremely shaken, unable to calm down for a long time. At the same time, Su Li, standing in the center of the martial arts stage, had a somewhat regretful expression on her face. Ah, it's a bit regrettable. The ZG Gong is not a cultivation method that focuses on strength, so there is not as much increase in strength. Although I have definitely improved a lot compared to my previous self, compared to the increase in speed and reaction ability, I still feel a bit dazed. However, it's also true, after all, the ZG Gong is not meant to enhance attack power. Self extreme intention skill is. Su Li murmured to herself. And below the stage, the people who had been watching the battle were already stunned. Is this? Is this true? Captain Broken B, was he really punched away by a graduate? Fantasy. Damn it. When was it? My favorite Captain Swayfong, how could he be defeated by someone? My mom. Su Li is so strong. So handsome. Please marry me immediately. Scalp tingling, brothers. With one punch and one kick, defeat the two captains and vice captains of the second team. The candidates were extremely excited and looked at Su Li on stage, admiring her with their eyes. On the stands, the members of the 13th guard team were even more excited than the candidates. In the match just now, these highly cultivated team members saw it more clearly than the candidates below. In their eyes, in the battle just now, whether it was the speed at the instant step or the temporary reaction ability, Su Li completely suppressed the broken bee. The punch that suddenly stopped at the end was a stroke of genius. So, except for the members of the second team, all other members of the second team stood up and applauded excitedly. Even some people whistled excitedly. Gong Qin, let go of me. Let me go fight that guy. This kid is really suitable for joining our 11th team. I must pull him to join. The wariness in Banmu's eyes was almost overflowing, and he was so excited that he rushed onto the stage. Ayase Kawakami beside him pulled him tightly. Senior, what's up? Let's wait until Captain Jinba arrives. It's difficult for me to do this like you. Ayase Kawakami's face was bulging with veins, and he tightly held on to the other person, his expression extremely painful. Actually, it's not surprising that these team members are so excited. A fresh graduate can be completely at a disadvantage in a 1v1 battle against an active captain, and can even make the other team suffer. This kind of strength is no longer a problem of lacking potential. Such a genius, 
placed in any team, is definitely a captain-level existence. May I ask, who wouldn't want their team to have an additional terrifying powerhouse? Even the members of the second team, although their facial expressions were not very attractive, looked at Suli with no malicious intent, but rather very passionate. Death worships the strong. So they wouldn't even think that Su Li's behavior was the following offense. On the contrary, being brave enough to showcase one's own strength and challenge powerful opponents is the admirable style of a strong person. Suddenly, Su Li on the martial arts stage smiled slightly and looked at the broken bee in midair. Captain Sui Fong, please show all your strength. If you have a lucky heart, you will lose very miserably. So, use your soul-slaying blade to fight me. Su Li smiled and said. He hasn't exerted all his strength in the battle just now. Su Li wants to see which step she can take if she uses all her strength. So, he suggested that the broken bee use her soul-slaying knife. However, as soon as this statement was made, the audience's face instantly changed. Because these few words are what Sui Fong said to Su Li before. However, now that Su Li has won a move against the broken bee, when he says it, it gives the impression that he is hitting the face of the broken bee. Such provocation is unbearable for ordinary people, let alone a high dot ranking captain. The members of the second team suddenly turned a collective black face, and the appreciation and friendliness in their eyes turned into anger. The other members of the team were stunned, their hands hanging in mid air frozen. Damn it, crazy. So crazy. I really like this kid. Ha ha ha. Banmu burst out laughing and looked at Su Li with incredibly bright eyes. Next to her, Ayase Kawakami was sweating profusely and quietly took out her communicator. Hey, Captain Jinba, where have you been? If you don't come here again, something big will happen. The group of candidates in the audience also had a big change in their faces, and their hearts were shocked to the extreme. However, they all dare not speak up at this moment. Everyone on site remained silent like a cicada. Because the broken bee opened its mouth. Okay, 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 kid, okay. For good things in a row do not necessarily mean they are really good. On the contrary, the expression of the broken bee at this moment is so gloomy that it can drip water. Her eyes were already filled with raging anger. Since becoming the captain, who dares to mock themselves like this? Even the most respected Lord Yi Yi in my past has never criticized me. Now, to my surprise, I have been humiliated by a young boy who speaks in front of so many people. Okay, it's really great. The face of the broken bee was extremely gloomy. She slowly drew out her soul-slaying knife. A powerful spiritual pressure emanated from the broken bee. She finally stopped suppressing her own strength. She is really angry. Cut, crazy woman. Banmo whispered with a dull expression on his face, then took a small step back. On the stands, all members of the 13th Guard team had a big change in their faces and looked at the scattered bees in mid-air with frightened eyes. The terrifying spiritual pressure left all the students on the playground in unbearable pain, with only a few still barely standing and the vast majority of students unable to even stand up. Sting and kill all the enemies. Sparrows and bees. The shattered bee's face was gloomy, and her eyes were full of evil energy, opening the beginning of her soul-slaying sword. The terrifying spiritual pressure has become stronger once again. Now, all the students on the playground collapsed on the grass. People looked at the scattered bees in the sky in terror, like a female war god. At the same time, the office of the team captain. Yamamoto Motonari's eyes, which were originally slightly narrowed, suddenly opened with a hint of surprise on his expression. Is this the spiritual pressure of the broken bee? Has she liberated the soul-slaying blade? What exactly happened? Immediately, he summoned Najiro Kurobe. Go and see what's going on. Najiro Kurobe nodded respectfully and took orders to leave. On the other side, the captain's dormitory of the fifth team. 
Blue Dai Sosuke raised his eyes slightly and looked towards the direction of Xinyang Lingshu Academy. His expression was thoughtful. Chapter 8 Sword 8 in the Opposite Direction You are listening at NovelFull.audio Looking at the crazy and demonic broken bees in the sky, the people on sight lost their senses. The terrifying spiritual pressure makes everyone feel suffocated. However, this is only the spiritual pressure unconsciously emitted by the broken bee. And most of the spiritual pressure is concentrated on the field. On that boy. People can't help but think in fear, what kind of pressure is Su Li bearing now? The crowd struggled to look up at the martial arts stage, searching for the figure of the young man. However, the expression on Su Li's face stunned everyone. On Su Li's face, there was a faint smile and a slightly surprised expression. Su Li is indeed a bit surprised. Because he found that spiritual pressure has little impact on himself. It can even be said that it is negligible. This is obviously due to the reason of Zijin Ji Gong. But upon closer reflection, he didn't find it difficult to understand. After all, in the world of Dragon Ball, Carrot often trains under tens or even hundreds of times the gravity. And now I have basically understood the Zijin Ji Gong. The spiritual pressure of broken bees is nothing at all. Maybe not even ten times the gravity has been reached. So, I haven't been greatly affected and still move freely. Su Li had a faint smile on her face. This can also be considered a small surprise. Suifeng looked at the smile on the young man's face, feeling both surprised and angry. This guy, seeing himself understand, it's okay if he's not afraid. He's even happier than before. I'm so angry. Stinky kid. Let's laugh heartily now. I'll tear your mouth apart later. If you get hit twice by my wasp, you'll definitely die. Don't cry and beg me to let you go then. However, if you are willing to apologize to me, I would consider letting you go. The expression of the broken bee, with a gloomy and terrifying sound filled with coldness, seemed to come from hell. Upon hearing this, Su Li's face turned black. Why is this woman so anxious? I just say whatever I have. Everyone put out all their strength and have a fair showdown, isn't that what she said herself? What, I said it won't work, right? So I won't speak, can I just smile? Can't even smile. Sure enough, women with poor chests have a bad temper. Su Li smiled helplessly and shook her head. I refuse. He spoke calmly with a calm expression. Okay, great, then I'll show you what true captain level strength is. The broken bee's eyes were filled with anger, and a chilling smile appeared on its face. At the same time. Jingling court, outer court. An extremely burly figure is running at full speed. Xiaoba, hurry up, run faster. Ba Qianlu lay on Jian Ba's head, shouting excitedly. Jian Ba's face was also full of excitement, and his feet kept accelerating. Where is it? Where is that guy? He kept muttering incessantly, with a look of hunger and thirst in his eyes. Since receiving the message from IAS Kawakami, Jian Ba and Yichiryu immediately set off and rushed to the examination room. However, it has been almost ten minutes now, and at full speed, the two of them have not yet arrived. In no time. Jingling Gate, West Gate, also known as Baidao Gate. The Guanban Si Dan Fang, who was guarding the Baidao Gate, saw a burly and tall figure rushing towards this side at full speed, and his face couldn't help but change. He finally recognized the other person when they approached. However, after recognizing the other party, Si Dan Fang couldn't help but not breathe a sigh of relief, but became even more nervous. Because the person who came was Jian Ba and Ba Qian Lu. Looking at the two terrifying captains and vice captains of the 11th team, Si Dan Fang felt like he was about to pee. He asked cautiously. I don't know the two captains, what's up with coming to the Baidayaman? Are you going out? 
After summoning the courage to ask this question, Si Dan Fong was already sweating profusely, with trembling hands and feet. Hey, Ba Qian Lu, are you sure this is the direction? This is the exit of Jingling Court. Jian Ba looked at the tall Bai Dao men with a puzzled expression on his face. Oh my, it's all Xiaoba. Your hair is blocking me, so I didn't see clearly. Ba Qian Lu said with some embarrassment, then extended his finger in another direction and shouted excitedly. This way, this way. I'm sure I can go to the Xinyang Lingshu Academy this time. Upon hearing this, Jian Ba immediately pulled out his leg and ran towards the direction pointed by Ba Qian Lu, with a renewed expression of excitement on his face. In no time, the figures of the two disappeared at the end of the road. It wasn't until the two of them left that Si Dan Fong breathed a sigh of relief in his heart. Facing the two captains of the eleventh team alone, the requirements for psychological resilience are too high. After a moment, he showed a hint of confusion on his face and looked in the opposite direction of Jian Ba and the others. Jinyang Lingshu Academy, isn't it over there? They have gone backwards, right? On the road to the Jinyang Spiritual Academy. The captain of the 8th Division, Jing Le Chun Shui, and the deputy captain, Ise Qishu, are moving at high speed. Jingle Chun Shui looked as if he had not woken up yet, clearly having another hangover last night. Hey, Zaya Kiksu, why do we have to? Ah, uh, yawn. Go see this graduation assessment. Jingle Chun Shui asked with sleepy eyes. Captain Jingle, the Xinyang Lingshu Academy is currently engaged in a battle. Captain Broken B has opened up the solution, the opponent is a graduate. As an intelligence team, our 8th division should arrive at the scene and collect intelligence. So, please wake up quickly, no matter how late you are, you won't be able to catch up. Ise Qishu said angrily. Oh, which furry kid dares to provoke Captain Mao Suifeng? Jingle Chun Shui was slightly surprised and immediately showed a hint of interest. His footsteps flashed past Chi Su. Xiao Chi Xu, run faster. No matter how late you are, you won't be able to catch up. Ise Chi Xu's face turned black and he quickened his pace. At the same time, the captain and deputy captain of each team were also rushing to the Xinyang Lingshu Academy. Some of them felt the spiritual pressure of the Broken Bee's initial release. Some have received reports from subordinates. But regardless of the reason, their current destination is only one. Jinyang Lingshu Academy Even Aizen, who has always lived in seclusion, and Fuzhou Shigahiro, who is recovering from illness at home, are rushing to the scene in the queue. Graduates who can force Broken Bees to open their minds are unparalleled. You must go to the scene and see with your own eyes what kind of guy he is. The leaders of each team had different emotions and thoughts, and they all accelerated their pace. Chapter 9 Free Extreme Meaning, Auspicious You are listening at Novel Full Audio. Not long after, Jingle Chun Shui and Ise Qishu arrived at the Xinyang Lingshu Academy first. As soon as they approached the exam room, the two were startled by the terrifying spiritual pressure on the scene. Looking at the group of candidates struggling to support themselves, as well as the members of the various teams sweating profusely, Jingle Chun Shui and Ise Qishu's faces slightly changed. Jingle Chun Shui was the first to react. Qishu, quickly set up a barrier. Feeling the captain's unprecedented seriousness, Qishu immediately adjusted his thoughts and began setting up barriers. The teachers of the college finally came to their senses and immediately ran over to help. In less than a moment, a golden and shining barrier rose up and surrounded the martial arts stage. The terrifying spiritual pressure finally no longer overflows. The candidates and members of each team in the audience finally breathed a sigh of relief. Watching battles under the spiritual pressure of this level is truly a very agonizing experience. After finishing all of this, Jingle Chun Shui turned his gaze to the competition platform. The scene on the field made him feel suffocated. I saw two figures on the martial arts stage, 
constantly flashing and chasing at an extremely exaggerated speed. The speed at which the two of them took a quick step was so fast that even Jingle Chun Shue, who had seen many people in the world, felt a slight shock. It is not surprising that broken bees can achieve such speed in Jingle Chun Shue. After all, Sui Feng is the strongest member of the active team captain, and many people refer to her as the strongest active team captain. What truly shocked Jingle Chun Shue was that her opponent also possessed the same terrifying speed. That young man's quick steps are no weaker than those of a broken bee. This simply makes Jingle Spring Water feel unbelievable. Several figures appeared beside the spring water of Jingle. Fuzhu and others also arrived at the scene. Not only Fuzhu, but also the captain and deputy captain of other teams followed closely and appeared in the examination room. The captain and deputy captain of each team looked at the two people chasing fiercely on stage with the same surprise on their faces. Their ideas are similar to those of Jingle Chun Shue. It's surprising that this candidate's instant steps can be on par with Captain Suifeng. Kamura Zwijin spoke up, his tone revealing a sense of shock. Under such strong spiritual pressure, it seems that he is not affected at all. What a terrible guy! Mao Zhihua's face also had a stunning expression. This kind of genius seems to be very suitable for our third team. With a fox-like face, Shimaru In smiled and said. No, they're not on equal footing. Floating bamboo seemed lost in thought and suddenly spoke up. You also noticed. Jingle Chun Shue cast an appreciative gaze at him. Upon hearing this, all the captains turned their gaze to the two of them. Although their speed seems almost the same, both of you have overlooked an important fact. Upon hearing what Jingle Chun Shue said, the other team leaders all had a puzzled expression on their faces. That's it. Captain Broken B has initiated the solution. And that young man is still in an ordinary state. Based on my understanding, the soul-slaying Saber Bird B of the Broken B not only possesses the ability of B Pattern Hua, but also enhances its various attributes after being unlocked. Both speed and strength will be enhanced. So, after starting the initial solution, the speed of the Broken B is obviously one line faster than that boy. Upon hearing this, the team leaders showed a wise expression on their faces. Immediately, my heart became even more shocked. Because, as Jingle Chun Shue said, the reason why Sui Feng can be one line faster than that candidate is because it liberates Shiji. And if it's in a normal state, wouldn't a broken bee not even touch a teenager? This fact shocked all teams to grow up. Unexpectedly, what Suo Weiman reported was true. In the previous competition, Sui Feng did indeed lose to that little guy. The village left team was deeply shocked. The other captains were also shocked, and they had received similar reports before. It was not until I arrived at the scene and witnessed it firsthand that the authenticity of the report was confirmed. At this moment, Jingle Chun Shue had a thoughtful expression on his face. Although it's only a slight improvement, it will eventually be caught up with. Young man, how will you deal with it then? On the martial arts stage, Sui Feng had already noticed the arrival of the team leaders. But she didn't care too much. I will never really kill Su Li. I just want to take advantage of this competition, teach the other party a lesson, and suppress this guy's arrogance. As long as the competition is fair and just, then these guys have nothing to say. So, the full focus of the broken bee was placed on Su Li. And what shocked her was that this guy was not affected by his spiritual pressure, and his speed still didn't decrease. However, it's okay. After opening up the initial solution, the speed of Instagram has been greatly improved. I can gradually catch up with this guy. Humph, stinky kid, when I catch you, I'll definitely punch you hard. The thought of the broken bee gritting its teeth. Continuously chasing, the figures of the two are getting closer and closer. At the 107th instant step, the broken bee finally touched the corner of Su Li's clothes. In the 146th instant step, the sparrow bee cut through Su Li's sleeve. In the 178th instant step, 
the sparrow bee swiped a few millimeters away from Su Li's eyes and cut off an eyelash. With the advantage of the front line, the edge of the broken bee is getting closer and closer to Su Li. There were several times when Su Li managed to avoid danger. The fighting spirit of the broken bee became increasingly high, and the excitement on its face became even stronger. Stinky kid, I'm about to catch you. Ha ha ha. The broken bee took a momentary step while laughing proudly. The people watching the battle from the audience also gradually became calm in their expressions. It seems that this shocking battle is coming to an end soon. Su Li's performance in this regard has exceeded the expectations of too many people. It is not an exaggeration to call such a brilliant genius the strongest graduate in history. Off stage, people began to talk and laugh, with relaxed expressions. Of course, most of the discussion cannot be separated from Su Li. People won't worry about what Sui Feng will do to Su Li, after all, such a genius will never be left unchecked by the 13th guard and let Sui Feng handle him. Even if Su Li agrees, the captains of each team will not agree. So, people are more speculating about which team Su Li will go to after that. After all, Su Li challenged Sui Feng and threatened to become the captain of the second team. But now it's clear that Sui Feng is about to win, so Su Li definitely won't be able to become the captain. Moreover, now that these two people are in such a situation, if Su Li goes to the second team again, he will definitely be wearing small shoes. So, the best choice is to go to other teams. Yes, that's right. In the eyes of those watching the battle, Su Li has already lost. However, in the next moment, Su Li's actions once again overturned people's thoughts. Su Li suddenly stopped in his tracks. It seems that this state is already the limit. He murmured to himself. The broken bee also stopped and looked at him with a playful expression on its face. What's wrong? Are you afraid? Do you want to give up? Ha ha ha. Then apologize to me. Sui Feng looked down at Su Li with a haughty expression. Su Li did not answer. Previously, he had always been in a relatively casual state and did not deliberately activate the extreme sense of freedom in his body. But facing the initial solution of the broken bee, it is still a bit difficult. Until now, he decided to exert all his strength. Although I may not fully grasp the state to be activated next, this is the strongest level I can currently achieve. Let the broken bees be their test stones. Look at yourself, how strong you can be after activating that state. Su Li slowly closed her eyes. After a moment, a faint heat emanated from his body. My hair also gradually dyed some silver. The audience at the scene was stunned as they watched Su Li's changes. Even the broken bee was taken aback. Amidst everyone's attention, Su Li slowly opened his eyes. The airflow around suddenly exploded. Free Extreme Intentioned Mega Chapter 10 Painting the Earth as a Prison Seeking Data is Spicy You are listening at NovelFull.audio On Su Li's hair, silver threads surround her. The airflow around me keeps exploding and rising. Seeing Su Li's appearance, everyone present was stunned. The broken bee looked even more puzzled. What are you doing with your appearance? She asked coldly, her tone full of confusion. The captains watching the battle from the audience had different expressions. Most people look confused. Only a few people have different emotions. Jingle's eyes lit up with spring water. I knew this kid, he probably didn't give it his all just now. Unexpectedly, there really is a killer card. Chi Su asked with a puzzled expression, Captain, how did you see that this young man still has a trump card? Jingle Spring Water gave a graceful smile, presenting a carefree demeanor that only old men possess. Intuition, intuition, Xiao Chi Xu, men's intuition is very accurate. Chi Su's face turned black as she knew that the lecherous captain would definitely say, Just like I can feel you like me. Chi Su swore that as long as he really dared to speak up, he would assign him two punches with a stick. 
Jingle Chunchue clearly did not realize that danger was approaching. Just as he was about to speak, he was interrupted by a floating bamboo beside him. You notice that young man with that calm expression on his face. Fuzhu coughed and then smiled and said. Jingle Chunchue's face suddenly showed a sense of disappointment. Yaha yaha, I really can't hide anything from you, Fuzhu. Both of them have been old friends for many years and have a deep understanding of each other's abilities. So, what was observed in the jingle spring water was also observed in the floating bamboo. Behind the crowd, Aizen was quietly watching Su Li on the field. The lenses on the face reflect cold light. This little guy is very strong, giving me a feeling that he is even stronger than Silver at that time. Moreover, his current state is completely different from just now. There was no spiritual pressure felt from him, but his aura clearly suppressed his opponent. It's really interesting. Maybe we can invite him to join my plan. Aizen silently thought, with an imperceptible curve forming at the corner of her mouth. And further back, a corner of Banmo was about to explode the contact device of Gongqin. Damn it! Why hasn't Captain Jinba come yet? I can't beat these guys. If you can't grab anyone then, don't blame me. Banmu's corner desperately poked the button on the communicator, and the nearby bow couldn't stop it. At the same time. Captain's office. Kazumoto Najiro reported all the information he had just found out to Captain Yamamoto. It's just nonsense. Captain Yamamoto drank in a deep voice, his eyebrows filled with majesty. Are these guys trying to turn the college founded by me into a battlefield? A captain of a second-class team in the hall, who still needs to start the battle against the students. The rules are getting more and more unruly. Immediately, Captain Yamamoto slowly stood up and walked outside. Kurobe Najiro's face was startled. Sir, just leave this matter to our subordinates to handle. Do you have to trouble yourself to go there in person? Captain Yamamoto's face was expressionless. I just heard him say leisurely, I want to go and take a look at that little guy fighting against the broken bee. Kurobe Najiro was greatly shocked upon hearing these words. Unexpectedly, Su Li's strength surprised the team captain. Even the captain was moved. By the way, you can also investigate the child's background. If my background is innocent. Yamamoto didn't continue. Instead he narrowed his eyes slightly and stroked his beard. Kwebu has been following Yamamoto for over 2,000 years, without any explicit explanation from the other party, and knows what the latter half of the sentence is. Fully cultivate. Jingling Court, South Gate, also known as Juwa Gate. Bastard. Are you saying, this is the exit? Do you want to die? Jian Ba's forehead was bulging with veins, and his eyes were filled with endless killing intent. Woo woo, my lord, please spare me. I really dare not lie to you. This is really the south gate. The guardian was trampled on the ground by Jinba, his face almost flattened, and he cried with a runny nose and tears. Eight thousand streams. Sword eight covered his face and sighed, feeling helpless to the extreme. Omitted, he mischievously spat out his tongue and blushed slightly on his face. All right, I got it. This time it's in this direction, it's definitely not wrong. Immediately, Ba Qianlu pointed in another direction, but this time, his voice clearly lacked the confidence it had before. Damn it! Gung Mujin angrily turned the direction and then ran away. Looking back at the exam room. Due to the changes in Su Li, everyone was discussing it one after another. On the stage, the broken bee hugged its chest with both hands and had a proud expression on its face. In her opinion, Su Li only underwent a slight change in appearance, everything else remained the same as before. The constantly rising airflow around him couldn't feel anything special. Except for a significant increase in momentum, there has been no significant change in anything else. The only thing that made her more concerned was that she still couldn't feel any spiritual pressure on Su Li. But this is not a big deal, maybe this guy has a way to conceal his spiritual pressure. 
As long as the ultimate winner is herself, she can be indifferent to everything else. How are you, how are you? If you're ready, then I'll start beating people. The broken bee put on a combat posture, with a playful look in its eyes. Well, I will be much stronger than before, so please give it your all and don't let me down. Su Li said lightly. Humph, you're on the brink of death, still acting handsome. Find a fight. The broken bee was furious and instantly unleashed the instant step to the extreme. With a flash of body shape, it attacked Su Li. However, as soon as she took a step, Su Li appeared directly in front of her. It's too slow. Su Li said lightly. Looking at the young man's face within reach, the expression on the broken bee's face changed greatly. In a panic, she instantly activated all her spiritual powers and retreated fiercely. However, before she could stand firm, she felt a figure blocking her path behind her. It's too slow. The face of the broken beat changed again. She gritted her teeth and changed direction again, trying to break through from the flank. The figure of the young man arrived as promised. It's still too slow. The broken bee still doesn't give up, constantly trying various directions. In just a few seconds, the broken bee changed direction seven or eight times. Every time, I only hear one sentence. It's too slow. Su Li's figure is like an invisible cage, trapping the broken bees inside. Everyone below the stage has already been stunned. Especially the captains of each team, their faces were the most shocked. Because they were surprised to find that Su Li's figure had been on her attack route since the start of the Sui Fang's dynamic attack. Offensive, which emphasizes charging, firing, and hitting, is a complete attack when the three are combined in sequence. However, with every step taken by Su Li, she stepped on the position where the broken bee had just begun to accumulate energy. The broken bee couldn't even make a move. Even now, the broken bee still stays in place, not even taking a step out. Truly painting the land is a prison. There are still two chapters left later. Thank you all for your great support and love. Cough cough, for collection, for flowers, for evaluation tickets, for all data. There is an echo here.